Hello students, welcome to Vyas Certification Quota. In this series of NCRT discussion, we are continuing further with the chapter from Mathematics Class 11 that is Permutations and Combinations. The interesting Permutations and Combinations and today is the turn of exercise 7.4. So let's begin the first question over here. Let's solve this question. The question says if NC8 is equal to NC2, find NC2. Okay. And what are the results that we have related to this NCR? We have a certain result that says NCP equals NCQ if it is given. This implies that either P will be equal to Q or, or P plus Q will be equal to N. These are the two results that we have. And this happens because NCR is also equal to NCN minus R. Right? This happens because this is true. NCR is equal to NCN minus R. Because of this, that particular thing happens. So let's apply that concept over here and see NC8 is equal to NC2. This implies that either 8 is equal to 2 or 8 plus 2 is equal to N. This implies this or this. And you can clearly see that 8 is not equal to 2. Since 8 is not equal to 2, we can clearly observe that N will be equal to 8. Once we find n, the next thing that is asked is nc2. Therefore, nc2 will become equal to, sorry, n is equal to 10 is what we'll get, right? Not 8 over here. Let's make that correction. Yes, this is 10. So this becomes 10c2, right? 10c2 and uh, what's the value of 10c2? This is 10 times 9 over 2 times 1, which is 45. And that is my answer. For this question over here 45 yes that's the answer for this question over here 